you can see the thickness is 12 millimeter and the width of the plate uh, let's see the feeding width. Is how much? The feeding width is uh, 557. The workpiece we just uh, gonna to test is 200 in width and 200 in height. So here's the machine we just uh, gonna to load the. Walk piece, the sheet. With the overhead and with the magnet. The first two station is for clamping the material. Let's see about the first uh, two stations. And for the for the first station and the secondary station, we have the side roller to regular the sheet position as well as there is uh, lifting this is the lifting elevator to adjust the gap of the roller we have the maximum we have the 12 millimeter and the most of the jobs we just are gonna to roll up 6.35 millimeter Each station of the each station of the roller is coupled with one piece of the motor. The rolling station motor power is 15 kW. It's 11 11 kW. The first is feeding roller, and now from this station we're gonna to rolling up the workpiece. The machine is super big and the higher. This kind of the side roller is also very important to adjust. Once we want to recover for same leg in height, left and the right. It's very important. This is the after after three station. Now it's going through to force station.
now it's entered into fifth station. It's going to six. It's going to six. It's entering to seven. The lola is so big, it's almost the diameter of the lola can reach up to 700. 7 and 8. Here is 8. And we can see the angle uh, just uh, forming up. It's about uh, like uh, 60 degrees or well formed. 6 going to Oh no, eight going to nine. And in this nice rolling station, we have this sort of the side roller, vertical roller. See, this is a vertical roller moving around the side of the groove. It's a vertical, the surface groove will move. This is the seventh station. And let's go to the eighth rolling station. And here is nine. Our front nine, we have this kind of the vertical roller. The groove of the vertical roller will match with the groove or the angle of the walk piece. We can see the roller is almost very big. The diameter can reach up to 700 or 800. 10, 11, this is 11 rolling stations, and the 12, here's 12. This is 13, going through to 14 stations. And we can see the vertical roller somehow is almost from both elbow side to the... And let's check. is the 15 station. From 15 station, it's gonna to enter into the last station, 16. It's entered into the last station very smoothly. Okay. And we gonna to run out to the walk piece to check the angle, the weight and everything.
and uh, during your production, since we feed it with the sheet material, so once the work piece is well round, we need the overhead to lifting up the work piece and the run out to the run out from machine. And let's check the work piece. So here we just gonna to measure the work piece for you. Okay? It's 200. One side. See? It's 200. Okay, let's move outside. Anyway, it's uh, it's also two hundred. Okay, so the the button width is about two hundred zero three. <laughs> 